Hello there and welcome to another SOLIDWORKS Electrical Quick Look. This is Alex Koch, Territory Technical Manager for the ANZ and today we address the question of how do I export electrical project data to Microsoft Excel. Now before we actually take a look at that question, let's take a step back and take a look at a more important question. Why do we do it in the first place? Why do we even have to consider Microsoft Excel? Well, for starters, being able to export this information opens up the gateway to a very fast and efficient method to globally update project information. It is very simple to use once you know how to. And of course, it is a secondary backup option. It allows you to create a very fundamental snapshot of your project information. It is also not limited only to component information. It can cover everything from project books all the way to location data and via styles. But of course, the question is, what are the steps involved? Let's take a quick look at it. So here we are in SOLIDWORKS Electrical Schematic. Our first port of call would be the Projects tab. Under Configurations, we get the Excel Export Import option. This brings up the list of existing templates that are available for us. For the purpose of this presentation, I will create a new one. And I will just give it an appropriate name, for example, Alex. And the description, I'll just give a dash. Of course, you probably want to give slightly more meaningful names here. I hit a next, and what we get here is the list of objects that are available for capture within the Excel template. For this presentation, I'll just capture circuit breaker information, contactors and relays, as well as motors down the list. What you notice is each object that is selected will have an associated number of fields to export as well. You can choose to export everything like what I'm going to do here, or you can selectively uncheck what you do not wish to be added for exporting. You might also want to take note that the objects that can be exported go straight down to things like wires and wire styles. When I hit the next here, what I get here is a summary of the fields that are going to be exported to the related objects. And when I hit the finish here, what I get is a preview of the template like this case here, alex.xlsx. And that's what we have for step one. So back in SOLIDWORKS Electrical Schematic, we now go on to the Import Export tab. And under Export to Excel, we go on to select the template that we've already created. Now earlier, I'd already created the alex.xlsx. And when I hit an OK here, what I'm going to do right now is telling the system that I'd like to use this template to export this information. I'd like to have it saved onto the desktop and have the folder opened after exporting. And what we see here is the folder actually showing up on screen here. Now let's take a look at what this Excel worksheet looks like right now. Now, from the tabs, we can tell that all the different objects, the three different objects that I selected earlier, have been allocated the appropriate information based on what's available within the project itself. Now, what are we going to do with this information? That's going to be a question for another presentation. So to recap, you either create a, a new configuration file template, or you can choose an existing one and define the objects that you want to have captured in the export. And then you fire up the command to actually select the appropriate template and export the information to Excel. Always remember that the objects are captured according to the definition in the template that you select. So one of the things that I like to highlight, of course, is please ensure that the Microsoft Excel version that you have installed on your system is a supported version before you attempt this. Please verify that if you're not sure on the SOLIDWORKS website, um, hardware and system requirements. Up next is, of course, what do we do with the file that we've already exported? I will be covering that in a different presentation following this. But for now, thank you so much for your attention. My name is Alex Koch. I am the Territory Technical Manager for the ANZ, and I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Bye-bye.